oh, it's lovely. I get to be a complete bitch about anything. There's one marvelous thing about infidelity. It puts a complete end to this nonsense of give and take in a marriage. Now we've had our rows. I'm always starting them. Men don't really like them. And then they soak, and then you have to apologize. But when they've been unfaithful, well, you can't put a foot wrong. I am broken-hearted, but look at the situation. It's my only opportunity to be the perfect woman. I can be obnoxious, irrational, unreasonable, and deliriously outrageous. I can throw my drink at him. I can spit at him. I can embarrass him in public. I can throw my wedding ring across the restaurant, and he's the one that has to grovel for it. I feel so female. I feel like Catherine the Great. <laughs> And I never give him a moment's rest. He never knows when I'm going to strike next. Three o'clock in the morning, I woke up. I look over, and there's David, all curled up, sleeping like a baby. So, I belted him with his traveling clock. <laughs> oh, poor David. He always thinks I'm going to say I'm sorry, but I don't. I shouted at him, you foul, filthy, dirty, adulterous pig!